Hi, Steve Spiker here from the OpenShift team. I recorded a couple of previous videos showing uh, some of the ease of use of the web UI and the changes that allow you to easily create applications, link them together, and get a better understanding of things. Then I also walk through how that is promoted, changes promoted, and how pipelines are integrated into that dashboard and can be used. Uh, now I'm going to show you how anyone, so this, this isn't some special uh, background build that I have, something in private that's using all um, upstream components, even the mechanism to set up this environment to get going quickly and easily. So I'm, I'm currently just running with a, a rel-based image on, on AWS uh, to show uh, what to do. I have downloaded the OC command and I'm just going to use OC cluster up. So what is that? Uh, it's a new command that allows you to just get a simple, small, uh, all-in-one instance of OpenShift going, leveraging uh, an active uh, Docker runtime. And so uh, there's a large number of options here, uh, but for the purposes of what I'm doing, I'm going to... Um, and so what I'm going to use is the options just to specify the public host name. I'm going to enable metrics. I'm going to use actually the latest versions. I'm going to set up a routing suffix that is actually going to allow me to use a, the zip IO service. And then I hit enter. So as it's going through, it's doing a number of things. Obviously it's checking the clients, checking dockers there, uh, ensuring the configuration is set. Um, going to ensure that all the right uh, images are are pulled and, and everything's current. Uh, API server is up and running already. Uh, set up the router, the registry, and metrics. So, uh, wow, that was that was pretty quick. So, I can now turn around and uh, come over to the console, like it said, using the web. And there's my developer, developer, my project. Nothing in it. If I want to add to project. I can grab the pipeline example and I can have the pipeline deployed and that quickly I was able to go from just a base Linux uh, system I installed the OC client I ran OC cluster up and it gave me it did everything I needed to set up a simple uh, cluster to play around with locally um, in an isolated all-in-one instance.